Bottoms. Hey, baddies. Hey, bitches. What is up? What's poppin'? And welcome back to the channel. I'm sorry. I have like too much adrenaline from the gym and pre-workout and whew, killer leg day. Things are changing for the better and better and better. I also quit smoking. So I'm just like super energetic. Anyways, fashion overhaul starting right now. This is outfit number one. I don't think there's like a theme for this haul. I didn't even get that much. So it's a small little haul. Um, and I think majority of it is like matching sets. So here is outfit number one. I love it. Honestly, I really, really do love it. It is a little bit see-through. Like I was doing a TikTok, I bent over, I could see like everything through the light. So definitely on the sheerer side, um, you probably are gonna wanna wear like some panties with it. That would have been smart of me. Anyways, um, the other thing is, it was a little bit awkward to put on and it still feels a little awkward wearing it because like there's only this little hook attachment from the sleeve to the tube top or whatever you call this. So I just feel like it was a little awkward. It took me like three tries of putting it on. I got deodorant stains everywhere. <laughs> I'm out of breath because I'm also doing TikToks simultaneously. Um, the angle is a little bit different because I don't have my camera tripod here. So you're literally on a chair, but it's okay. We're going to make it work. So this is outfit number one. Really, really feeling it. It is cute, definitely can take some bomb ass pictures. Half the times when I order stuff from Fashion Nova, it's not something that I would technically wear outside. If you ever, ever <laughs> see me in public, I'm nine times out of 10 gonna be wearing leggings, gym pants, sweatpants, looking like a bum. <laughs> I don't know, like, because I just, I'm not like, and now I kind of have the body for it. I'm not the type of person to go outside like this. Like this body honestly calls for enough attention on its own. So wearing something like this is just asking for a lot more as wrong as that is. But anyways, this is outfit number one. Definitely feeling it. I wish it was a little bit thicker, not as sheer. Um, it doesn't really have much compression. It's just really cute. It has like little ruffles for like the detailing. So that's super, super cute. I mean, on camera, it definitely is looking cute. Waist is looking snatched. I don't know if you guys can see that. The gym is like doing some justice to my body. Um, and I'm just like feeling so freaking good. Even with whatever flaws I know I still have. It's all about faking it till you make it. So um, definitely liking this. It is full length, full length pants. Um, you could probably wear this honestly with some sneakers or some heels. Um, it doesn't really matter. It depends on what vibe you're trying to go for. I would probably do some sneakers or some flats um, because I just think it would be cute. I don't wear that many heels. But yeah, this is outfit number one. At the end of the video, let me know which one was your favorite. I feel like I've only really done Fashion Nova and maybe a few Sheen hauls. It's just that Fashion Nova is just honestly so affordable and I just buy things for pictures. Like, I don't have time to spend all this kind of money. The other day I spent $50 on some Adidas pants. The same exact day, I don't know how I got oil on them and ruined them. So it's like, I'm not, I'm not, I don't, I'm a mom. I don't got time for that. All right. So here we have outfit number two. I think I have the same exact set in different colors. Yeah, I have it in a brown color. And then I think this, and then this is like a rainbow color. And everybody really loved this. I'm not used to this color, um, but... I'm feeling it. This is honestly more my like everyday style. Like I would definitely wear this to go outside, put some comfortable sneakers on, go out to the supermarket, run some errands. It is just super comfortable, super stretchy. It is on the very thinner side. Um, I'm pretty sure. Well, because of the color, I don't think, yeah, it's not really see-through, but it's definitely just on the thin side. Um, just super comfortable, flexible. Um, not really much to it, but I still like like tie-dye designs. I don't know why, but I'm not really feeling this color if I'm being honest. Um, but yeah, I would wear it. Ooh, ooh. I would wear it just for like errands, as I said. Like there's nothing that's like super special about the outfit. It's an oversized type t-shirt, some little biker shorts. That's pretty much it. Um, just basic. We're basic right now. Okay, I am really feeling this one. Number one, I absolutely love leopard print. I don't know if that makes me old or what, but I love leopard print. I kind of love the way it looks on me. It's just honestly my whole aesthetic, my whole vibe. Not enough to put it like in my home, but like for clothes, we're good. 
but I really like this. It's like an oversized, like baggy crop top shirt. I would definitely need a bra, which I don't have one on. And I would definitely need like maybe a t-shirt if I didn't have the bra. Then I probably wouldn't. Yeah, if I wear a t-shirt, I probably wouldn't need the bra because it is like really loose. I was just filming a TikTok and like I had a bunch of slips. So um, yeah, but it's still really, really cute. I love that it is oversized. It's very loose and flowy. Um, the shorts are just super cute. You can honestly see like the whole waist and stuff like that. I really like it. I Again, I just love leopard print. This is like very comfortable, but at the same time a little bit sexy and dressy, but casual nonetheless. Um, it is very comfortable. If I had a bra on, I would feel way more comfortable to literally wear this outside right now. Um, but yeah, it's really, really cute. It's not see-through. It's not too thin. Um, it has a little bit of texture to it, but I really, really like it. You see how loose the, the shirt is in the back? It's really cute. I really like it. Um, yeah, I don't know what else to say. I just really, really like it. I think this is one of my favorites so far. Maybe the black, then this one. So I really, really love this set. I love the colors. I love the two-tone. I love the tie-dye look. It's like sexy, classy, sophisticated, all in one. Um, I wish I had the confidence to like wear something like this outside. I just feel like this literally calls for attention. Number one, the colors are bright. Number two, it's so body fitted, um, but still super cute. Like if I did wear this somewhere, it would probably be like a lounge, honestly. Um, not like a regular everyday outfit. Super cute. The top is like a little bit of a turtleneck crop top got thing going on here we got a long like full length or below knee um length skirt i just really like it it's super cute <laughs> that's it i don't i like i don't have that many words to, today all right so this matches the whole easter theme right easter's coming up i love tie-dye i know like i feel like i'm old like tie-dye and leopard print, I don't know, I feel like I'm really old school, but I really, really love this set. The only thing, like, I love these baggy sleeves, I love the crop top. Again, you need a bra, or you need some pasties, or you need, like, a t-shirt, another cropped white beater, or something like that under this, and it would be super comfortable, without worry. Um, but the pants, these are XL, but it's, like, a little bit snug. They're not super high-waisted, but I'm okay with that. But I know, like, I would have a problem because, like, every time I bend down, like, crack <laughs> would be showing. Um, so that's the only thing. I wish the pants were a little bit more stretchy. Um, I actually, for the first time, because I usually always wear high-waisted. If you see me looking here, it's because of the mirror. I usually am so used to high-waisted, and these are not high-waisted, but I'm still feeling them. I just wish they were a little bit larger. This is an XL set, so I don't know, like, what else I can do, but that's just kind of, like, my own personal problem because the body is a little bit awkward. You need a larger size to get past here, but even then, some sizes run a little bit smaller. Um, but I really still am feeling this set. Um, this top, I would probably wear with some, like, jeans. I honestly don't think I would be wearing these shorts outside because they're just too small for me. Um, so this is just going to be for pictures, honestly. But it's cute. It's cute. I'm feeling it. It's cute. Okay, so last up is this outfit. I didn't even remember that I ordered this, honestly, and I almost bought another Easter outfit yesterday, but I'm pretty sure I had Easter in mind when I picked this outfit. However, <laughs> I am not comfortable with all this exposure. Number one, I don't have cleavage, but even if I did, I definitely wouldn't be comfortable with it. I just feel like on Easter, this is a little bit too sexy, especially because I usually go out with my daughter. I go to the cemetery to see my mom. Um... My father will be out of town. Usually I would go for breakfast with him. I mean, it is super cute. Like, I would probably wear like an all black cardigan over top. This cat. I would probably wear like an all black cardigan over top just to make myself feel a little bit classier. It is really, really cute. I love the pants and they're like super like flaring at the bottom. Um, so that's cute. They have a lot of stretch. This, I'm not sure if this is how it goes. I'm really not a fashion person. Um, but I mean, I feel like it looks really cute. Again, I would just probably wear like a little white sweater or a black cardigan over top. Um, it's like a little bra top. Simple. 
nothing too, too, too fancy, nothing too sexy, but at the same time, super classy and still sexy at the same time. So, I mean, I like it. This cat. So, yeah, I definitely like it, but I don't know. Let me know if you guys agree with me. Like, is this too much for, like, Easter? Do I definitely need to wear? Yeah, I could even wear a blazer over top of it, right? A blazer would actually really look cute because I feel like a cardigan would kind of play it down. Yeah, I think I'm going to get a blazer. I think a cute little blazer would look really, really cute. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much a wrap for this video. At the same time that I'm filming this, I'm making this funny, at least to me it's funny, TikTok showing all the outfits. So it's like I'm out of breath because I'm like doing TikTok. I'm doing IG stories. I'm also filming on the camera for YouTube. So anyways, let me know if you guys enjoyed this video. Give this video a thumbs up, please. It really helps me with the algorithm. I really, 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 really want to grow this channel, especially now more than ever. Um, I'm still going to be doing try-on hauls, but for the most part, the rest of my videos will be like my fitness journey related topics and things of that nature. So yeah, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, follow me on Instagram, follow me on TikTok, subscribe to my OnlyFans, and that's a wrap for this video. Stay tuned for the next one. Bye, guys. Meow.